What is up in the army? I am Gibner Air 5 coming at you with a brand new video and welcome to Gamer Talk episode 21. This is uh well big it's episode 21 even though the episode 20 was probably more big than this. Anyway <laughs> Welcome to episode 21 of Gamer Talk GT21 as the short way of calling it. Anyway, welcome to the next uh, Gamer Talk. It is so amazing to be back doing this. And, um, well, we're gonna still line up, but I'm not gonna get into that yet. So, well, look, well, actually. Yeah, I guess we can, but let's hit the intro! Now I can actually do the, um, show you guys the lineup for today. It is a stellar lineup for GT21, and we will be kicking everything off with, with well, with Versus first. That will kick off GT21, and then going, then we will head to Movie news, which pretty much is just a Marvel spe special, even though it's May, and you would think it'd be more smart to talk about Star Wars stuff in movie news, but no, Marvel literally hit, hit the world with a banger uh, this week, so we're gonna talk about that. <laughs> and then, going to the third segment, we have MC Challenger. And then, to round everything off, like usual, we have Out Now, along with the next question. And without further ado, let's head to Versus! So, for Versus in GT21, we will be doing Bane versus Batman in Injustice 2. Now, if... I've already recorded it, that's why I know what it is. Now, in that, in the part, I, I didn't actually know what it was until after picking the characters. Because it went into it going blind. Anyway, with that, Bane versus Batman versus in GT21. Let's go. Okay, I am back in Injustice 2 for the next version of Versus. I did turn off all the music, so hopefully we don't have that issue again. And I'm not getting any sound. So, great. Um, <laughs> I'm not getting any sound at all. It doesn't look like you guys are either. Anyway, uh, so let's go under single player. Uh, play one on one. And uh, let's see. Who are we doing to 
today. I, this, I actually have not decided on. So, um, I, um, hmm, this is a very good question. Um, let's go Bane, then we'll go up against Batman. And, uh, I am not getting any sound. Whatsoever. <laughs> um, let's just go random. There we go. Now I have sound. <laughs> that was weird. Oh, there we go. Much better. <laughs> I know what you did to Selena. I have not tried hiding the truth. You're going to wish you had. Begin. Okay, here we go. Okay, so far so good. Okay, so far not so good. Oh! Okay. We'll silence your shame. Oh boy. <laughs> oh no. How do you do that? I actually don't know how you do that. It's not good. <laughs> Um, hmm. There we go. Oh, I did it. I did it. Whew. I don't know how to do my special. Still have not figured that out. <laughs> oh boy. With that, guys, I'll see you guys back at the desk. Another versus and another win. Uh, I don't even know how many wins I've gone in versus now, but uh, I think it's more than I'm pretty sure it's more than one. But I'm pretty sure I have lost at least one or two. I can't fully remember though. Um, I think it's one or two. I can't remember. I really can't. <laughs> anyway, so. Versus out of the way. Next is movie news. And uh, I actually had to write up uh, cue cards to, uh, so I'd know what, how to talk about this. So if you didn't hear about it, um, I think it was Monday that it happened on? Anyway, this week, Marvel completely shocked everyone and released uh, announced names of films release dates of films two release dates we already 
pretty much new. Um, one got uh, pretty much confirmed, uh, and then the rest were pretty much just added. Well, actually, no, we knew about another one of these. Anyway, I have them all listed under two over two cue cards. One of them is out of order, so hopefully I don't mess that one up. Anyway, <laughs> it was the site I was reading, uh, copying, uh, uh, writing them off of. Um, so, honestly, the two that, the three that we already kind of, I'm pretty sure we knew the other one, but at least the two that we did know the dates for were Black Widow, which is coming out July 9th, um, 2021. That is this summer, and I can't wait to see that. Then there's um, Shang-Chi and the Legend of the Ten Rings, and that is coming out September 3rd, 2021. I'm pretty sure we knew that one already from the trailer that I think we watched in in GT20. Then, um, the Eternals got officially confirmed for November 5th, 2021. We'll see if that gets pushed back, but uh, November 5th, 2021 is the Eternals. And uh, that, that might be quite interesting. Then um, the next one, I don't know if we already got a date. I don't know if this was already confirmed, but Spider-Man No Way Home is now is coming out December 17th. This, this this next December this upcoming December, so that'll be interesting. You hear my dogs bark now. Anyway, um, then the next Marvel film after um Spider Man three is Doctor Strange: The Multiverse of Madness, which will be coming out March twenty fifth, twenty twenty two. That's the first film of twenty twenty two. And, uh, yeah. Then, after that, there's Thor Love and Thunder coming out May 6th of, uh, that year. 2022, sorry. And, um, then there's also Black Panther Wakanda Forever coming out July 8th. And that, that's just my, uh, July 8th, 2022. Um, Though, that is just my entire list <laughs> on one of the cards that I wrote out, so. Then we also have, um, the Marvels coming out November 11th, 2022. That's a weird date. But I find that date very strange. I, I don't know if it'll stay there, but currently the Marvels, which is Captain Marvel 2, will be releasing November 11th, 2022. And then the next uh, film is Ant-Man and the Wasp Qu Quantumania, Feb which will be coming out February 17th, 2023. And then the last film that we have a date for is Guardians of the Galaxy Volume 3, which will be coming out May 5th, 2023. Like, talk about craziness, eh? Um, so, the, I'm pretty sure that's 14 films. We also got, they also confirmed Fantastic Four also, but didn't give a date. Um... And they also didn't give dates for pretty much any of the other shows. They also did announce, not on the same day, well, it was kind of on the same day. No, they didn't announce it on the same day. They announced that Loki will be releasing not on Fridays, but on Wednesdays on Disney+. Plus, Which is kind of interesting because everything on Disney+, Plus releases on a, on a Friday. So, it's a little odd, but okay. Uh, I'm pretty sure June 6th is when, uh, Loki kicks off. If that's Wednesday, then it is correct. But I honestly, I'm not sure. Let me check. June 6th? Nope, that's a, I got the date wrong. Probably June 9th. Anyway, Wednesday. 
<laughs> so, um, yeah. With that, that is everything that Marvel announced this week. It's crazy. And, um, yeah. Now, on to the next segment. And that is MC Challenger. Also, I have this challenge written down on the card. Because, well, it's a crazy one. It's, uh, if you do, if you, uh, think, if you remember back, if you go back in time in GT history, in GT episodes, don't know which one we did this on. Uh, I finally have a name for challenges like these, so. This, the challenge for today, MC Challenger, is called a double challenge. Now, it's technically three things, that, but I, I'm calling it a double, and, um, we are, the challenge is, we have to get an elytra and crossbow shot at the same time past the 50 mark on, you know, the big green, uh, seal thing. Yeah, you know what we're talking about, if you've seen it before, you know what we're talking about. Then after that, we have to go through the boat and go in the boat and go um, throughout the boat course and uh, complete that. And if we complete all that, then we are then we win the challenge. This challenge also has already been filmed because I didn't know how it would go. And here we go: MC Challenger Double Challenge GT21. Okay, so I am on Minecraft now. I am on the server, and uh, today, um, we are, uh, as you know, we are doing uh, MC Challenge. I and I probably already said it, but if not, I'm going to say it again. Um, today it is a multi challenge, as I like to call it, and it will begin at the Lytra course and I already marked it, uh, where we have to get past we have to get past 50 on the Lytra course as we're doing the light trip we have to also shoot an arrow via crossbow and we have to get past 50 so if we get past both of the past 50 on both of these then we switch to the boat, and if we success, or if we do that part successfully, then we win the challenge. And um, yeah, so with that, uh, I guess I'll take some or orange carpet. I need a crossbow and an elytra. Also, by the way, we are going to be putting in a brand new Elytra course here that's going to be more challenging. It'll be interesting to see uh, how that, how much more challenging that will be. But uh, now I need a crossbow. Load it. And now let's climb up. The tower. Okay. We have to make it past that line and bo both those orange fences. I've been debating m removing this hoop. Okay, we have done this before. I can't remember where we landed though on that part okay, so. Ready Set
Where did we land? We landed like here. Here, I'm pretty sure. Uh, where did the arrow land? Oh! We got past it! Right there. So, uh, what would that be? We were seven. That was 70. It's in the 70 range. So, it's 70, 71, 72, 73, 74. Okay! So, 74 it's at. Okay, so 74. What the? Why did I break that? <laughs> So 74, and for us, we were on this line, and that's 100. So 174 on the um, Elytra and Arrow course. And now, it's time to, uh, well, do the boat, which is easier. Get the bow now. If you haven't seen um uh the um boat course, well you're about to. I haven't changed it. I was meaning to, but I I I ran out of time for this episode and yeah. So it's still the exact same as the last time we did it. Now, we technically have actually done two versions of this course. We did one on the uh, new server, and we've done a version here. I can't remember how many times, so. Um, so, with that. Uh, I, you know what? I think I'm going to go all the way. Oh, I broke a ladder. Great. Well, I think, honestly, we're going to go all the way to the top. Are we at the very top? Let me just check. Yep. We are. How do you even get to the level below this? Oh, it's too dark. Got it. I didn't notice we went past it. Okay, so we're gonna go from this area. So, um, let's uh, put some water down. Okay. Now all that is going to flow down. And now, I, I will run you guys through it in case you guys aren't aware of it. So we start up there in the top of what I like to call the Magic 8 Ball. And then we come around and we hit all the buttons on all the lamps and get them all lit up. And then we come here, then when we get here, we win the challenge. That makes sense. So, yeah. Boat. Okay. Ready? Set. Let's go. Okay, and we are now down at the bottom. Okay, got that light. Mm, nope. Ah, I did get it. Okay. I couldn't see it because it's dark out, and I have two lights that are pretty much blinding me. <laughs> I have my two, um, spotlights on. Uh, did I go past one? Y 
Yeah. There we go. Okay, that's another. <laughs> Jeez. Okay. Um. Oh, there's another. Okay, that's another. Then this one is the hardest of them. It's because it's on the bottom of it. How is that not hitting it? Good God. <laughs> there we go. Got it. And there we go. And we win. <laughs> that was a, that was the hardest. I've that that was actually quite difficult that last one. But we did get them all, even though they aren't lit up anymore, we did get them all. So, with that, I guess, we're, let's head back to the desk for the next segment and the wrapping up of this segment. I will see you guys back at the setup. Goodbye! Okay, so, MC Challenger complete, we won again, it was really hard at the end because it was in night and I really should light that course up more, but um, I think it brought, it made it more challenging and if you didn't catch it in, um, in the part, we will be adding a new electric course. Which might mean we also add a boat course because I have a feeling I know what I'm going to do for that. So it's probably going to be like a really big, um, like dropping zone. It'll be very interesting to see when that gets done. I think we rumored it a year end last year. I think. I don't know. Anyway, uh, I'm aiming to get that done for whatever GT will be this September, but, um, MZ Challenger, Double Challenge, Elytra Crossbow, and Boat, complete, we got the win, and now, let's move on to, technically, the final segment, and that is out now, I honestly actually have no idea what is out, <laughs> Um, I don't think much came out, is coming out right now, or about to. Nope. I honestly I don't think anything came out this week. So um Yeah, I I I you know when I did all my research for this episode, I should have also done research for out now. Uh, so in my view nothing nothing of too much importance has come out this uh Friday. I could be wrong. But I'm pretty sure. I'm recording. I'm recording this on the Thursday. If I was recording this on the Friday, then I would know. But I'm recording this on the on the Thursday. I don't know. <laughs> so with that, guys, let's head to the next question, which I do not have up. <laughs> oh, one sec. <laughs> And it's actually a very fitting question for uh, GT21. 
uh, goes along well with, um, uh, movie news, and that is, what new Marvel film or show that's coming are you the most excited for? Let us know in the comment section below, and, um, I'd like to see, see what you guys think, um, like, there is so much coming, I'm pretty sure, uh, just from Monday, they, they uh, confirmed 14, announced 14 films, and confirmed, uh, release dates for 14, for a couple of them. Anyway, with that, it's time to wrap everything up, I'm giving you five from the Army team, signing off, I hope to see you all in the next video. GT22 will be June, and um, yeah, so I hope to see you all then. I don't know what the next video will be, it will be something, and I will see you guys then. Goodbye!